Hogwarts, this is I! Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy! Where my last video, if you may recall... Um... Ah, good, we have tons of moonstone. This is exactly what I wanted. Anywho, let us, um... Let us decide what we're going to be doing today, may I present... Yeah... What am I doing? What am I doing? What, what am I doing? What on earth? What on earth am I doing? Alright. I need venomous tentacular and acquire and use a mandrake on multiple en enemies simultaneously. Right. How do I find a... Uh, I guess, I guess, room of requirement? Guess maybe room of requirement? That's not it. Uh, room. Let's hop into the room. There we go, pals, pally pals. No, I no unidentified gear. Don't passion. Vision. Wait, what was I doing? All right. So I need acquire maxima and endurance potion. And use them um, simultaneously. Very well. That I need money for. Ah. That I also need money for. I need a focus potion. Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Deke hasn't seen uh, this many plants here before. Oh, damn. No, I planted the wrong one. Oh, no. Damn it! Oh, whatever. Well, uh, cannot believe how many beasts you have here. Yeah, tell me about it. I haven't even bought any beasts yet. I mean, while I'm here, um... Yeah, I haven't even bought any beasts yet, but I could do. I could do. Yes, I could do. I could very much. Wait, how do I get them though? Uh, does Von get them though? Right, so how much is a broom in hearts? None from Sebastian yet. I wonder where my next, um, my next quest is. You're back. Nice to see you again. Yes. What are we looking for today? 
Right. Oh. We need a hundred pound. We need a thousand. Well, I'm afraid that costs a bit more than you have. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by. Hope a to see you again. A bit more than I have, yeah. That might be a bit of a problem. Come on, there has to be somewhere where money is present. Because right now, I'm poor. Why is everybody crowding around me? I'm poor. Yeah, they'd be like, hey, hey, pal. Hey, pal, keep your poor away from me, you poor person. Ah, oh, yeah, stop, stop touching me with your paw! Oh, God. Hogsmeade, here I come. Right. Now... Right, what to do now? What to do instead? We have literally... have... I literally have nothing. I've literally got nothing. I can't even pay for a thing and it's ah! demanding delivery. Speak with Parry Pippin. Yeah. Actually. Wait. Hold on. Maybe this will give me money. I, all I need is a thousand pounds. Sorry, cat. Excuse me. Oh, it's in here. In the market for potions, are we? Yes, we are. Um, what can I do for you today? Uh, oh, wait. Wait a minute. Uh, I hope to see you again. Good day, well, for now. Yeah. All done. Uh, yeah. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. Oh. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. Invisibility potions? Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Okay. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often? Right. Giving me no time to brew. If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily pay well. the delivery fee from Fatima. Very well, um... I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requests. Oh. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. Oh dear. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Okay. Right, invisibility potion time. Well, looks like I will need more money, and I think helping that put that man out will. Why do I keep pressing? Oh. Time travel again. This is TARDIS time. Come on.
may take a while. I didn't know when you said south. I didn't mean you. But you meant south, south. My goodness, this map is so big! Always late that Pippin. Hello. Madam Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Yes. Did he have your brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Uh, um... I, I shall, uh... I shall say, um, here are the potions. Here are the potions you requested. I you don't need to get so too much detail. I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Drink it. Very well. Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. Yes, um... Right, uh, how do I drink potion? Uh... How do I drink potions? Uh... Okay, how do I... Yes. I know what to... Ow! Alright, what the heck is a potion? Drink the invisibility potion. How the hell do I... Uh, how do I drink something? Right. Uh, controls. How does one? Uh. Right. Where the heck is a potion? Okay, I uh, just want some. Uh, how do I? Might be a bit difficult to... Thank <laughs> you. 
How do I drink potions? I, I... Okay. What do I do in order to do that? I'm... How do I do that? How do I do that? Okay, let's try this. Uh, um, uh, uh, ah, here we go. See if this will do anything. If it isn't, I'm going to lose my mind. Why the hell can't? Why can't I drink anything? Come on, you piece of. Poopy, poopy! Right, okay. How do I do this? I don't know. Wait. Oh, idiots! Me! Ah! Uh. That, that's the endurance potion. Ah. There we go. Give free invisibility potions. Very well. It seems to have worked. Yes, it hmm. does. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? Ha! <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Very well. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. Uh, I'll say, um... What do you have for sale? What do you have for sale, what may do you I ask? For today? Oh, interesting. Uh, Wigwell's potions. Well, I don't want to waste all my money. I'll come back later. Thank you for stopping in. Yes. I appreciate it. Yes, you're welcome. Also, you're you're Welsh. Yes. I, I know that dialect from the sound of that female's voice. Anyway. Tardis time! Demanding delivery! Oh, I need to use the mandrakes. But I need money as well. Ah, what do I do? Return to Barry Pippin. I want to do a thing, but I want to do another thing. But TARDIS is the most Inferior of Time Lord weaponry. I don't see how the Doctor manages to pilot this thing.
Which reminds me, Red Nose Day, there is a Doctor Who thing that I must see. It involves the tenth doc the fourteenth doctor doing weird things as per usual apparently that's the area where Severus Snape died Oh look a car Sorry, I love pointing things out apparently Oh, perfect. Initiating landing. Sorry, I killed everybody. No, why am I not? There we go. That's how you do it. First try, trying to land, but failing repeatedly. Oh, cat. Great, I have time. I always have time to pet cats. I always have time. Yes, indeed, I always have time to pet cats. I always do. Sorry. Pardon, excuse me, coming through. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? Uh, she was um, certainly difficult a little bit. I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Yes. Thank you. Oh, yes. Uh, I'll just say... Delivering those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well, I shall increase your pay, but I'm not at all pleased about it. Best of luck with your potions, Mr. Pippin. Do take care. Very well. How much money did I get? Whoa, 500 pounds! Let's do another awesome thing. Right. That's one quest down. Tearly a decorating. I mean... Interesting. We could ask to be hired for a job. I had no idea you had... I had no idea this was basically real life. Hello. Ah, hello there. Oh, hi. Oh, are you busy? Sorry, sir. I will go. Right. Ah, screw that paper. I will come back later. You're worrying far too much. Nobody's looking at you. Why did you buy Yes. Honey Dukes, I've heard of this area. Hello, it's so this is Honey Dukes. Perhaps I should speak to the manager here. Are you a being of unspeakable power? Apparently you're busy. Right, what to do now? Interesting. What 
to do? I guess we could, um... Interior decorating. have to pull so right so I need an endurance potion and maxima potion right well best not dilly dally best look for potions wait oh yes I remember it's in the same place! It's in the same damn area that I was previously! Let's just teleport! Let's just investigate! Let's just buy! A potion! Okay. But ah! I need to also upgrade my broom! Very well. So be it. I will, um... Uh... uh hello? I'll be with you in a bit. Yes, um... Yes, interesting. Do we need that? No. You have a good head for business, haven't you? Indeed I do, indeed I do. Um... Interesting. Um... Um... I guess we could sell that. Do we even need that? Uh, uh, golden eye dragons. No, I want those. Wait, hold on. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Yes, indeed. Tell me about it. Let me just, uh, right. Um, That looks weird on me. Do we even need that anymore? I don't think we do. No, no, no. We don't, we don't. Um. I guess we could get some random outfits and then sell them on the black market. Anybody got some weird clothes at all? Right. I guess it's time to head back. We could, we could see if there are any quests at all. Oh. Yes. We shall go there. Emergency temporal shift. We wish to have some more money. We wish to have some money, which is cool. Yes. Yes. Right. Okay, so. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. You're right on that. You seem like an answer as to why that portrait was empty. You seem like one who has money. I wish I really have made a mess of things. Hello there. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. Hello. Oh, I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. 
Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. Right. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. Ah, that sounds amazing. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Right. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Yes. I suppose I could help if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. Very well. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Okay. Yes. Plus this will give me money, so obviously yes. Hello. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. Yes. I spot you there. I am the great. This is the greatest plan! That's right. You get the meme. Hello, Kay. I got distracted. I need to find a book. What the heck? Ah, where are you, book? Ah, what? Oh, interesting. This must be Cressida's diary. Yes. I'd want this back too if I were her. Yes, indeed, indeed. Let me just save. Uh, Let's save. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Perfect Amundo. Where do I go? Where are the other books? Give me. Give it to me. The book's gotta be somewhere. Where would it be? Paves better not be anywhere. Perhaps let's have a look at here. Oh. There's another one. Revelio. Continue looking for more money if there are any. If there are any forms of currency. Oh, cool. Forty-five pounds. Rip off. Yes, kidding. 
I'm rather impressed. There's a. We have. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Yes, we could. Or. No, we don't want to break anything. Let's not break anything. Let's return and give them back the books and my goodness my eyes are getting weird. What are you up to now? I'm simply just doing things. Let's have a look. Ah, I see. Anyway, let us continue our adventure. There appears to be no one left. They are all dead. Where is the universe? This is all gone. We have got them. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Okay, here you go. Ah. Uh, perhaps a reward to keep the diary a secret. Unless you want your classmates to know how you really feel about them, you might reward me for my time. Oh, you're not at all who I thought you to be. I wouldn't do that to you, Cressida. Only trying to teach you to be a little more careful. Uh. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. <laughs> now. To work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I, I should start joking. brushing up on my Latin. Right, how much money Thank did goodness, we get? Some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me. Hmm. Yes, indeed. How much money did I get? Uh, I don't know how much money I got, but okay. Wait. I just realised. Um... Well, we have about 946 pounds of money. That is good. I was almost... I was also almost going to trick the child, but I guess not. It would be immoral. But then again, I am known to be immoral. That's not it. Where's the money? Uh, have I got anybody? Um. Oh. Parents? But wait, I can sell those things from... I guess we could do another quest. We could do another awesome quest thing. Mini mission. Let's do a mini mission then. Do this. Come on. I don't wa I don't want to... S uh. yeah. Do you think I'm impressed? I don't care how many chops it took, please! Leave me in peace! What the heck? Alright then, pal! Oh, oh, wait, I just remembered. Oh, yes, of course I remember. The Undercroft. Can we go in the Undercroft? I want to see what's in here. No one will know I'm a sussy backer. Anything new? Uh, there doesn't appear to be anything. Oh, perfect vest uniform. Ah, let's have a look. See what else is round here. 
Oh, a lace sorcerer's hat. Interesting, but uh, why would I need that? An identified head item. Let's hope. Let's hope Sebastian doesn't know that I'm. I'm feeling things. Excellent, I got what I needed. Time to do more questies. I guess we could sell those. We could sell those to someone. That would be fun. Yes. There's literally no one here. There is no one here. Hello. Ugh. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello. I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. Hello. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. Yes, thank you. That's nice to hear. I have had my share of adventure. I hope my reputation's warranted. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hecate's class, ah. and, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a, a puff scheme. Oh, yes. Uh. Oh. Uh, what's... Oh dear. Ugh, well, they seem innocent, but their tongues can be most I, disturbing. I have no exactly. idea what that is. I wish more of our fellow students agreed with you. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of puff schemes to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me puff Skeen Dunkeen. Oh, have they now? I'm sorry to hear that. Words can be cruel. Thank you. Poppy keeps offering to help me in overcoming my fear, but I'm too afraid to take her up on it. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. Wait, what? The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Wait, what? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. Oh dear. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that, well, I'd gone in. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. Very well. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Come and find me if you get the proof. I shall be forever in your debt. Very well. Impressive. Hmm. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Sounds intriguing. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Interesting. Yes. Very interesting. I'd like to see your parents. Ah. Right, so if if it is heavily guarded, I will most definitely require um It's good black children are too young. Uh Ah, so, I hope it's not too, um, heavily protected, but certainly something I do not want. Oh god, ah. Uh. Accio! Ah, 
here. Get the page. Bucker, 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 bucker. Hey, stop running away. Uh, come on, you. No! Oh. There we go. Ah, so... Wait, hold on. Oh, wait. Is this one of the areas? Ah. Rebellion. Find and enter the hidden herbology corridor. Really? Looks like we're going down there then. Is this these dry vines are one spark away from becoming kindling? Good for you. There you go. Oh, oh, we're heading in. Heading in into a weird building now. This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. Yes, indeed. Wait. Devil's snare. Oh dear, not this again. <laughs> Lumos. Lumos. There we go. Lumos. Seems the Devil's Snare was protecting a chest of some kind. Yes, indeed. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. Mm. Ah! Lumos! Ah, oh, we have sixteen. Sixteen amounts of money. Wait. Wait. Wait, venomous tentacular? Wait. Caretaker... Oh, wait. Wait, venomous tentacular? Professor Garlic. uh... Oh, Quine use venomous tenta. That's the exact thing we need. Oh my goodness! Yes. Lumos. Right then, 
Let's head out of here and climb up the weird hill thing. Protego. Why do I keep pressing Protego accidentally? Anyway, it's time to head out of here. Right. Whee! Oh, so. Oh, bugger. We have a lot of venomous tentacular now. Oh, let's. Oh, hold on. Ah, oh, so that's how I do the quest. My gear is full. Oh dear. Well, I didn't know that. Ah. Turn to Duncan, wherever the heck I open the door. I guess I have my door here then. Ah, so that's how I do it then. Wait. Ah, oh, there's, um... Right, so where are the mandrakes? Ah, I see, interesting. Hello! Don't mind me, I'm just looking for things. Let us return. Right. Oh, everybody knows you're in the Have you found anything to, uh, prove my bravery yet? Hello, Duncan. I have the proof you wanted. Yes. That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. <clears throat> it's even more than I expected. Indeed. I knew you were the one to ask. Yes. I appreciate you getting it for me. Yes, indeed. Of course. I hope this helps you prove yourself. This is sure to put an end to Puff's in Dunking for good mm. when I show everyone in the common room tonight. Yes. This will show ever how ridiculous that nickname was. Mm. Thank you again, and have a good day. You look like Harry Potter. I know I will. Thank you for all of your help. No more Puff's in Dunking for me. Mm. Yeah, indeed. Anyway. Uh, anyway, um, that had that to Hogsmeade, because the reason why I want to add that back to Hogs. Wait, how much money do I have? Wait, how much money do I have? I mean, I... Gonna... Oh, that looks badass. Then, bugger. Just destroy something. I'm out. Oh no. Just destroyed something. I might have just destroyed something. Damn it. Take things. Be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. How do I, um. Identify. 
leather sorcerer's hat. weird, but okay. <laughs> uh, do we even need these gloves anymore? I don't think we do. Okay, whatever. Um, Most of these I don't think we need now. Let us return. I do need to do that uh, quest as well. again. Continue. Let's continue our quest. Yes, we shall continue our quest and upgrade our broom. Let's do this. You're back. Nice to see you again. Yes, nice to see you. Hold on. Wait. I just realized. Oh, there we go. Go. I wish to. What are we looking for today? I wish to sell some things. We even need these. Good lord. Um. Seems good. Um. Um... Let's purchase. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Thank you, yes indeed. Well... I must tell you, Arthur Vogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Very oh, well. You consider it, won't you? Yes, very Honestly, well. Let's really do this. Yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Okay, let's... Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races! Oh, yes. Sweeping the comp. Off to the races, then. Yes, indeed. Off to the races. In fact... I think while we're here, we might as well... It's time for another horse. Why do I keep pressing that button? Thank you, thank you. Uh, oh. Gravel, I think it's time for another awesome flight. Uh, more, uh, another awesome um, lecture. Oh, Dr. Glad 
Gladwin Moon. Who's Gladwin Moon? Are you him? Oh, you are him, I see. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. Unsteady. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! Uh, and from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that what? curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. If you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, yeah. Why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Okay. Ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Really? Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. Oh, a really? shifter, if you will. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. And this one took the form Nothing of Nothing scares me! A demigeyser. <gasps> and before you ask... Terrifying before you say doctor, before you Holy say doctor, man. viewers, I encountered one as a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demigods. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Okay. Mm -hmm. A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Really? Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, unwarranted, however, hey. have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them, so uh, I can go about my evening duties. Very well. Um, um. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. Yes. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Hmm. Alahamora, that's how. But what about okay. curfew? Curfew? Ah, oh, tosh! I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital. Oh, dear. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. Prefect's bathroom. Okay. A. A. X. Y B A Let's do this. Hmm. Hold on. Uh Dressing. What's the... Where's 
så lär jag hemma och... Uh, uh. Aloha, Mora. Oh. Well done. You're in. Yeah. Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. This is a restricted area of the castle, after all. Yes, indeed. Um. Time to hide. Yes. Right. Oh, is it time to do a sussy thing again? generation of coddled cape flappers that can scarcely tell the difference. Right. I think it's time to end anyway, because there's Professor Weasley in that. Anyway, um... My fellow subjects, if you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe for more. See you all in the next video then. Farewell. Thanks all for the enjoyable video today. Don't forget to click below to subscribe to be official Dalek Empire. Or you will be exterminated. There will be no resistance. And the God of all!